Hello everyone, this is Fish Guy Rodney with Exotic Fish in Tanks. What I have here are two five and a half inch clown tanks from Sri Lanka. These guys are gorgeous. They can be on the aggressive side. Uh, they got in a fight, so I had to put one in here. Uh, five and a half inches. He, they got in a fight, so he does have a mark the one in the thing, so he'll have to heal for about a week. But with that being said, I'll show you the picture of the other one. I mean, these guys are stunning. Picture perfect, five and a half inches. These guys are from Sri Lanka. Currently, I'm giving them a two hour bath in nitroferazone. So the yellow you see in, the, in there is the nitroferazone and the Paragard as well. So I give them a two hour bath. After the two hour bath, a fresh water dip for five minutes. After the fresh water dip, they go into a quarantine system with hyposalinity 1.008 to 1.009 along with Cooperman and Prozipro for the flukes. I hold on to every fish for at least a week, quarantine them for a week. I guarantee they are eating as well. So I guarantee that they are eating. And I hold on to them for a week. After purchase, I've had to, unfortunately, I, I've had customers who have had me hold on to fish for literally five weeks, six weeks. Uh, and unfortunately, I just can't do that anymore. Um, what I should have done was simply refund the money and resell the fish, because they were nice fish. But with that being said, I hold on to every fish for a week before I sell them or before I ship them. If you purchase the fish, the longest I will hold on to the fish after you purchase is a week. And if you can't take shipment of them in a week, I cannot hold on to the fish. Uh, as I said, I have customers who have asked me to, um, or, or who I've ended up holding fish for over a month and just no more of that. So, uh, but in any event, all fish are healthy, all fish are eating, all fish have been quarantined at the very least for a week. Freshwater dip, nitrofurazone, which is, which is an antibiotic, Paragard gets fungal and bacterial, and here's another one in here, he's a little bit darker, can't really see him. They were fighting, so I had to put him in there, and again, the yellowish tint to the water is the nitrofurazone. It's not swamp water, which is what uh, I had a customer accuse me of shipping the fish in, swamp water. In any event, uh, these will be listed um, on my website before close of business today, before the end of the night. As I said, this guy that got in a fight, he has a little scar and uh, it'll take him a week or so to heal. So. I will heal them. I should have known better than to have them both in together. They were in there for an hour and 45 minutes with no issues. And then the last 45 minutes, they freaking start fighting. Dang it. In any event, uh, go out to my YouTube, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel, hit that notification bell. In the description, I have the website address and my own Facebook page. I have my, excuse me, my own Facebook group. So subscribe to my Facebook group. It's also, as I said, in the description. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Any questions, 469-682-8841. And with every online purchase as well, not only do I quarantine a fish for a week, not only do I guarantee a live uh, arrival, not only do I also guarantee they will be eating. I also include for absolutely free, uh, eight to nine dollar value safety stop by Blue Life. It's an instant quarantine. So while you're acclimating the fish, this is what you should quarantine them in. It gets fungal, bacterial, it gets just about everything. Parasites, absolutely free with every online order. If you want a step-by-step -step how-to video, go to YouTube and just search for safety stop there's an excellent step-by-step -step video by Mark Levinson. Does an excellent job in explaining everything step-by-step. -step. 
Any questions, 469-682-8841, Fish Guy Rodney. Thanks, everyone.